Hey there everybody, Thet here, and welcome back to Thet Plays the Darkest Dungeon. Last time, super exciting, uh, Boisman, Joubert, Bercy, Courier, actually went into the freaking cove and fought a freaking Kraken and somehow won, or Siren, excuse me, don't get it twisted. I don't know how it happened, but I just, yeah. This time, we got a different crew, and we're not going to go to another boss. We're not going to fight the Sodden crew. Uh, I think we're going to sail to hundreds of small islands, each a little bit more different than the last. I'm going to go to this, uh, maybe get a warrior's bracer out of it. It could be a good time. We're going to take some new classes as well. We're going to take the Hellion. Here we got Sation. She doesn't like mankind. And that said, she resists bleeding and she's also a little bit nervous we got potion x on her she has a self heal with adrenaline rush breakthrough iron swan and wicked hack so damage damage and also some damage port is a bounty hunter he hates beast he hates eldritch he also has imposter syndrome but who doesn't in this day and age collect bounty mark for death so he can mark him then he can do a lot of extra damage to him he can uppercut for a stun and knockback and then he can flash bang for a stun and shuffle Pretty good set of moves here. He's got a Agility Talon, which is a Bounty Hunter Trinket. Gives him a good amount of dodge and one speed. And then we negated that one speed with the Life Crystals for 20% extra HP. So he's he's a tanky boy. Now we got Urkeambor. Urkeambor? This. This name. <laughs> he's an abomination. He has a chance to turn any miss to a hit. He's a Yokai Slayer. It should be good in the Sunward Isles. He's also obsessed with cleanliness. He has all of his abilities, of course. And we have two items for him. Extra stun chance, extra blight chance, and extra virtue chance. Well, isn't that sweet? Works out perfectly. And then finally, Volville. Antiquarian. Sunward Phobe. Doesn't like the Sunward Isles. That's alright. We'll probably be okay. She's deadly. She's pious. She can blight. She can up our dodge. She can do a tiny heal, and she can protect herself by forcing enemies to attack someone else and give that person extra dodge and protection. So that'll probably go to who, who has the most dodge right now. Sation. I'll probably be going to Sation then to protect me. Apparently it can only be used three times per battle. She also, the Antiquarian, helps us pick up more treasures during our journey. So this is perfect for a short mission, I hope. Let's uh, take some FUD. And let's take all the FUD. Let's take all the shoves. Take two of though each of those. We'll take a skeleton key. Who knows in this day and age what we need and what we don't. Now we can take an Omori and see what it does for us. Keep us over 10,000. Let's see what happens. You can retreat from combat and even abandon quest. If things are going terribly, live to fight another day. Indeed. All right, we have we have docked. Explore ninety percent of rooms. Well, there's a two hallway or a two tile hallway over here. I feel like that's some easy rares. Hello, we have arrived. How are you, yokai's? Yokai everywhere. It's okay. Our abomination hates them, so we could throw down some blight. And honestly, their blight resist is pretty low, except for the wandering yure in the back. I don't like the Shogoru. He's annoying. And of course, the Lesser Oni can hit hard. Invigorating Vapors will actually up everyone's dodge. And then there's the heal and the protection. So I think we're going to start with protection. There we go. Four rounds of protection for Sation and a Mark. But I think we can live with the Mark. Can we get a Double Blight? Can we get Double Blight? Oh yeah, the Vomit Comet coming through right now. He can't use Breakthrough in the front. Interesting, but we can use Swan to try to attack the Yurei, but I don't think our chances are good there. I actually like this a lot more. Good damage, good damage, and then keep it going with a kill. Love it. Nice whale. We weren't listening. Retaliating rhythm. That's going to give them all repose. For how many turns? Three turns. That's rough. That's rough. Holy jeez! 
And he's the one guy who can't heal himself. What the hell? Fortify his vapors. Alright. Slap him. Okay, at least that stops him for another round. I'm actually tempted to bring her to the front. But no, he this guy hits too hard. Point at him. Now he's marked. Next turn we can do some good damage to him. Ah! It's grievous and exposing. I don't like it. Ah, the dodge. All right, the stun was really good, like 10 out of 10. Ah, I tried the bite. That's not lovely. That's not lovely at all. Now, ah, here comes another whale. We are unaffected by your wailing of torment. Take this! 19 damage! Eat it, boy! Out of my house. Damn it! She's too dodgy. We can't put her down for good. Yeah. Ugh. Lower dodge and speed for a couple of rounds. You know, we can live with that. See if we can get this, the blight again, and he's done, son. All right. So with him down, now we just have to find a way to attack the back row. Damn, that's some great resistances. That works. That, that'll help. That's much appreciated. Absolution, please. Absolutely. Beautiful. Great is the weapon that cuts on its own. I mean, next time we hit with the chains. I mean... Yeah, I know. We're tr not trying to tarry, okay? We got it. This, this is the last turn. Guaranteed. 10 out of 10. E well, if you could hit her. Keep with the healing. It's a slow process, but it's an important one. There you go. We get a minor antique. The antiques are unique because they come from the antiquarian. And I should have had her open that chest because you would have gotten another one. That was my mistake. Gotta keep the freaking... Gotta keep the antiquarian selected here. Right, don't mind me. Yeah. Thor just has his toy. He's having a good. What the hell? We have met these adolescent crabs before. I don't remember them. You know what? Get you to the front. I don't like your buffs. Hey, no, that's not bad. It's not what I was looking for, but it's not bad. Their blight resist is so low. We have like guaranteed blights on these boys. Benthic whip. Oh no! We've been whipped benthically. That actually ups his blight resist. I mean, that was some solid damage, but not enough to get the kill yet. Let's... Actually pile on the blight while we got it. Yeah, keep it going. Oh no, his blight resist is down. That ups his speed. I'm dumb. I can't read. Don't worry about me. He whipped again. Oh, it's a stun. Oh, God. that Half of our team is stunned. That's not good. The Abomination's Blights are going to be huge here. Needless to say. Especially since it's two per round. Oh, lordy. That's bad. Don't do it. Oh, God. What? What is that? Nice dodge. What the hell was that? Meek rebuttal. Okay, so they're not good in the front row. This is good to know. Don't thwack, don't thwack me, bro. What is Nihonon? Oh my gosh. Extra damage received while bleeding and blighted. Yeah, I want to get rid of that when we can. You know, just when the opportunity arises, get out of my house. The less back row there is, the stronger we are. Keep up the vomit comet, my dude. Third person is dead. Oh, good damage. Not enough to get the kill, but is enough to guarantee the kill next turn. Hmm. 
Lowering the dodge, obviously not good. Nice crit heal. I mean, it's not a lot, but it's a crit heal. Of skill and Beautiful crit from Seishin. Just what we needed in this trying time. Slowly, gently, this is how a life is taken. This team doesn't have perfect confluence, but it's okay. We're doing As things. Mount, so too will resistance. Let's give you some food. Yeah. Hmm. An old shrine bell. It might sound rather nice. Do you hit it with a shovel? Yeah, let's hit it with a shovel. Antiquarian, shovel it. It had no effect! I could have sworn. Alright, just do a thing. I mean, that's nice. Alright, barrel of blades. Gotta use the bandage. Right. <laughs> kind of forgot that that was the upgrade for that. I don't know how much I like this so far. Maybe this is not the right place to bring the antiquarian because we're not. Yikes! Finding a lot of treasures. Such missteps are the exception, and not the rule. Yep, definitely bandaging that. The minus accuracy is not a big deal. All right, now, behold. Littering. Or antiques. Trinkets and baubles. Paid for in blood. Ooh, the background here is very pretty. Except for the, you know... Except for these guys over here. The, the, and these guys over here. This one doesn't have a head. Hey, even with them, it's still kind of pretty. Let's freaking go. Nice dodge. I mean, we're not getting any scouts, so at least we're getting something out of it. Uh, what if I do this without? Yep, 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 yep. It tried to disease me. It's all right. We didn't put up with that crap. Nothing yet. Okay, we know we have one battle. We know we have one use of a shovel. So there's three battles up ahead. We we're gonna have to pretty much fight. What the hell is that? You guys are playing Go. These Go contenders seemingly died in the process of solving a complicated puzzle. What puzzle could be worth dying for? I don't know. Do we burn it? We don't burn it. Look over it. Okay. Yeah, that's cool. That's fine. A spitter. A regular ass spider. In this day and age. Can you believe it? You know what? Keep throwing down the heels. Especially if you want to keep critting. Because that's some free, easy, cheesy, stress releasey. Damn it. Oh, that was maximum damage. That was really good. Now, hopefully, we just don't take too much damage. I think spreading it around was... Actually, okay that time. Resist. Nah, I really want your blights, though. That's okay. I think we got this. Oh, yeah. What a perfect round. Blight him. Or just kill him. That works, too. Excellent. Oh. Awesome. Come on, port. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. What a champion round. Perfection all around. Uh, eat some more food. I would give it a Volville, but I want Volville to have others protect her. We're probably going to make more use of that coming up here. Let's go over here. Yep. We have two more hunger procs that we can survive. Hello. Goodbye. Give me more torch. Give me more torch. Oh, okay. It's a brittle baka kajira. That's fine. This is fine. We're all fine. This is what I wanted. Big, big, big money. No whammies. What I'm trying to say is I hate this. 
He has 100% stun resist. We do have 120, I don't know, 110% blight chance. Or stun chance, I should say. Uh, but he is blightable. He is 100% blightable, so we should try to take advantage of that. Let's use Protect Me. Because this guy's big and scary, I presume. Destroyed. Thank you, Sation. That actually helps a lot. Expansive destruction! What, you just try to get swole? What the hell just happened? Don't look at me like that. With your face. Don't look at me when I hit you. I see him every time he every time I hit him. He looks straight at the screen. It's creeping me out. What's up our dodge? It's not a lot, but three dodge can build up to something great over time. Weep for the dead. Don't tell me what to do. Yeah, that's obviously a stress attack. Looks like with a debuff too. I mean, he doesn't seem to be tough so far. You know what? Let's up our damage and accuracy for a couple of turns. We'll slap him extra hard next time. Dodge, please. Get that dodge up in there. Get that damage up in there. Oh no, he's going to expand. No problem so far. Looks like upping our dodge has been pretty good for us thus far. Alright, do we point at him again? Or do we punch him? I guess... I guess we just keep hitting him for now. I mean, his health's low enough. There you go. Plus 13 dodge. Mmm! Nice. Okay, he's dead in it. Two turns. Uh-oh. We're weeping. Oh, that's horror! Horror and minus crit chance. I hate it. You know, we're actually going to absolute here and try to fight back some of this horror. Because we can't stop it. Good hit. Ninagi Baba. An elderly woman is embedded in a tree. Perhaps she has some information. Hello. Oh. Laden with loot hmm. are often low on supplies. Some mediocre woodcuts. Seemingly simple, not very notable. They may fetch a small price. And mon bundle. Wow, lots uh, lots of treasures. Problem is, they're the types of treasures that uh, take up very specific slots. You know, if I go here, I'm technically done, so I don't need the shovel. I could take the mon bundle. Everything else, though, I think we kind of need. Eh, you know what? We probably don't need the key. Let's head back. No! A battle! Why have you done this to me? Frick. Frick! And it's a full battle, too. I suppose, uh, you know, those half battles that the kids are used to these days. Gotta use the Vomit Comet. I mean, we got one Blight, which is a start. Go ahead and use Protect Me. That way we can be prepared for the Vicious Assault. Nice hit! That was very nice. That was also pretty darn good. No, not him. He's not the one you're supposed to be assaulting. Crap. <laughs> I hate it. Wait, what happens if you double it? Nothing. Okay, that's good. Why? Why attack the bounty hunter? Crap. Crap! The good news, he's gonna blight out next turn, guaranteed. I think that was worth the vomit comet. I this can't. Okay. At least you're attacking the one you're supposed to attack. Eerie timber. It's so creepy. I'm creeped. We're spooked, yo! 
All right, everyone has repose, so we might as well just go for kills. Okay. Nice dodges on that timber. I guess everyone here is just deaf. Go, get the stun, son. Just realize their stun resist is garbage. I like helping dodge. It's an interesting strategy. No. No. Not the soothing tone. Minus 20% damage received? Oh, I'm actually insulted. Impressive. Apparently, Port was also actually insulted. It's what you get. All right. Go for another heal. I mean, we probably won't. Well, no, there's one more fight. That's right. We got kind of screwed there. Because this fight came out of nowhere. Literally. Don't do it. Mm. Freaking blue jeans, your eerie timber music. That's all right. You know, just get rid of one of these corpses. There you go. That puts them in place. Hi there. How you doing? Would you like a nice case of the dead? Nice pickup. These nightmarish creatures can be felled. They can be beaten. Uh, does anyone have some long-term effects on them, though? Let's go ahead and get rid of the medicinal herbs. Grab more gold. And keep the ka coming. Moving on. Okay, two, two curios and then a fightio. Lost cargo. Empty. It's garbage. You know what, let's use this... Right before we go to that fight, let's use that Omomori. Or right when we get into it. Form a man-powered carriage occupied by the wealthy. Its occupant must have been attacked. Its former occupant must have been very wealthy. Ooh, a rare antique. Okay, we can fit seven items into this spot. That's pretty good. You know what? We are done after this. I'm going to use all the torch. As the light gains purchase, spirits are lifted and purpose is made clear. Of course, it's just crabs. <laughs> I hate these crabs, man. Use them, Amori. Okay. Extra protection and less stress when attacked by yokai for a couple of rounds. Actually, two rounds is perfect because that's how many it's going to take for them to probably want to do their leap. Let's try to get out of the way of the leap. And then let's just keep slapping them as hard as we can. Slap them as hard as you can! That's what I'm talking about, Sation. As hard as you can. That's not, not as hard of a slap. That still worked. Ew. Don't like it. Don't do it. Yeah, buddy! Here it comes. Ah, no dodge. No stun, though. All right, they all have a bunch of extra speed this turn. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Oh, thank goodness she dodged it. That was actually a little bit worrisome. Because that's some healthy damage. Dude, this Vomit Comet is, has been amazing. That guarantees his death. All right. My minimum damage. Uh, not quite as minimum, but we got two blighting out this turn. And that feels good. Let's see if we can get him a stun. Oh, no! Oh, maybe. Oh, yeah. That was a ride, wasn't it? I point at you. With blood! Look how they added blood to that. As if that makes a huge difference. Well... Our stress isn't exactly where I'd like it to be, but things are going all right. At least promises success. Maybe we can see what's over here. It's only four hallway spaces. No? I mean, how bad could it be? How bad could it possibly be? Two maggots and a young Shoguro. Two maggots with repost. All right. That's a thing. I think whipping you is the first best move. Because you might be able to get 
We should be able to get some one-hit kills over here. That free-ass stress relief. You know you love it. Give me that free ass stress relief. With impunity. Yeah. Easy rares. The wounds of war can be healed, but never hidden. At least our abomination will have, you know, decent stress. Decent stress levels, I should say. Compassion Acceptable. In the feet of of Love it. Another Omomori. Torch. Brought low and driven into the mud. I don't know. Does, doing, does putting anti venom on this do anything? Nah. Does putting the Omomori on it do anything? Nah. And I don't want to touch it and get a disease. There's always a chance it wouldn't happen, but chances are something would happen. Oh yeah, I forgot about the Mikasa Obake. They they suck. Crap. But we can still vomit on him. He did not get the blight. That is unfortunate. Dodge. Can you point at someone? Now this is the question of the day. Can you point at someone? No, don't pass your... Oh my god. Port. Port, you damn fool. I should have left. We should have just left. We were doing okay. We were fine. We were healthy. And then Port had to get a case of the I suck. You should call that thing self-fulfilling prophecy, I guess. Oh, I'll get furtive on your ass. Don't worry about it. Nice dodge, Volville. Oh, now you want to move. Okay. No, that's, that's fine. At least you hit hard. I appreciate that. Don't touch me. It's gross. You're gross. Alright, that's a blight out from the crab. Or on the crab, I should say. Now let's open the pile on the blight. No luck. But don't drink water. Don't drink water. What do you think this is? You think you're a hydro homie? Don't do this. Oh, it's done it. It's gross. It's gross and we don't like it. Back to the pit. There you go, buddy. All right. Now we just pile on the Kappa because the other two will eventually blight out. Maybe. Never mind. He's doubling up on the restoration. Well, the crab's still gone. Because I think the Blight goes in first. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Are you joking? They happen at the same time. I'm mad. I'm mad! What? You extreme ass weasel. You! Oh, I'm going to give you the business, dude. You know, our abomination was almost in a situation where he didn't need stress relief. And then you had to come up in here and be an ass. With your cucumbers. And your heels. Take this. Yeah. That does have a chance to lower protection. And it also ups his own speed, which is interesting. Punch him. He deserves it. Show him. How did you not get a freaking stun there, dude. Crap. No crits, no problem. Bleed is low. In fact, we can heal the bleed. I wanted our abomina- Dude, why will our abomination not move? Finally! Oh, that's all I wanted was a little bit of stress relief on you. Okay. Just some easy, squeezy stress relievey. Don't do it. Crap. <sighs> Get the hell out of my house. Rampaging ass weasel.
Oh, you don't have to tell Port about that. He has no confidence in anything. Especially himself. Me in real life, you know what I mean? Okay. 16,000 gold from a short mission is pretty damn good. 20 crest is actually a pretty nice pickup, too. Level ups for everyone. Imperturbable! Less chance of being surprised. That's pretty good. Thank you, Abomin- Er, you're not the Abomination. You're the Antiquarian. Cove Tactician for the Abomination is pretty good. Mercurial sucks. Pious is fine. Works well with the, uh... With the Exorcist. Ruminator. Not that great. Valiant. Less horror duration received. One per roster. That's pretty good. I'm okay with a Valiant Station. A fresh irritant to some. A sanguine memory to me. Alright. They are going to have to have stress relief. Pretty much all of them. So let's go ahead and put them in where they need to go. Port. Good lord, Port. Uh, get your stress relief on. Volville. I'm just going to go ahead and give you the whips. Sation, you'll probably be fine with just meditation. And you're you're going to be fine with just meditation as well. In fact, you'll be ready to go after some after a little bit of meditatus. Okay. Take everything off of them, of course. And get ready for the next run. That's going to be it for this episode of That Plays the Darkest Dungeon. If you enjoyed it, make sure to let me know by giving a like if you haven't already. Don't forget to subscribe for more. It's going to keep coming. It won't stop coming. Till then, thanks again for watching this episode of Darkest Dungeon. My name is Fat, and I will see you in the next video.